Former 7 Network sports journalist Josh Massoud has lost a defamation appeal over reports he was fired after threatening to slit a junior colleague's throat. Massoud sued over publications on his suspension and later dismissal after phoning reporter Jack Warren saying, If you weren't so young, it come up there and rip your head off and s down your throat. The Sydney-based journalist believe his colleague, who was working in Maruchador, Queensland at the time, had mistakenly published an exclusive story contrary to an embargo. Redmore, two dead children were in Auckland storage unit for years Warren was brought to tears by this call and left work early in distress. The story, which was about a high-profile rugby league player transferring from his Queensland club to Sydney, may not actually have been an exclusive, the court found. Masood alleged the Daily Telegraph, Fox Sports, 2GB, 9, the publisher of this website, and Kiss 106. 5 defamed him by wrongly suggesting he had wanted to slit Warren's throat in the phone call. In July last year, District Court Judge Judith Gibson dismissed the cases, finding that most of the publications were substantially true and that Masood was not entitled to damages. Read more, conveyor belts of cold fronts approaching a state's brace on Thursday, the NSW Court of Appeal upheld this decision, throwing out the lawsuits and ordering the ex-journalist to pay the media outlet's costs. Justice Mark Leeming, supported by the other two appeal judges, found Masood had threatened Warren despite never having met him in person the sense of the words Mr. Masood in fact used was to convey and reinforce the anger Mr. Masood felt at what Mr. Warren had done, to intimidate him and belittle him, the judge wrote. Whether using the word s, or slit, the meaning behind the statement was the same and could not be taken literally, Justice Leeming noted. He was not threatening in fact to rip off Mr. Warren's head and defecate down his throat. Likewise, if Mr. Masood had said that he would slit Mr. Warren's throat, he would not have been understood as in fact threatening to do that. Masood failed to show any error in Judge Gibson's decision, the appeals court said. Read more, Kiwi climber loses leg after brutal 24 meters fall in Yosemite.